Hey y'all, Irix Guy here, and within this video, I'm going to show you how to lock and unlock the Volkswagen Passat. Now, the same procedure may work with other Volkswagens too. Now, my particular vehicle, and you can check out the review video on it, it's a 2017 Passat SEL Premium. So I've got this key fob. Now, it does have a standard key that'll pop out, but I should never have to use that unless the battery in my remote dies. And check out my other video, I've flashed it up here. If your remote battery does die, how do you use a key to get inside your vehicle? That's a totally new, different topic. But for your typical scenario, you got a working remote and you want to unlock your vehicle. So all you do, you double tap that bottom button. It looks like a lock with the unlock symbol. So now it's unlocked. Now to lock the vehicle, there's a couple ways I can do it. I can push the top button. It says it has a little lock symbol. Push it twice. At least on my model, a good indicator it's locked is that the mirrors went in. But what's really cool, at least with my model, I can put these keys in my pocket and I can approach the vehicle. Now looking at the door handle right here, if you look closely, you'll notice a little indention right there. My finger. That locks it, but it was already locked. But to unlock it with the keys in my pocket, all I got to do is that. And it opens the door. I close the door. The vehicle does not automatically lock. And again, a visual indication, at least with my particular trim level, is that the mirror's out. But now if I take my finger and touch this little indention, the mirror goes in, the car is locked. So with the keys in my pocket, you know, a typical scenario, I would just walk up to my car, I would open the door handle, it would, you know, it, all, it would unlock when I grab the door handle. I get whatever I need out of my car, I go for a drive or whatever, and then I lock it, just push that button. Super convenient, works well. Again, there's always, it's always good to have a backup, you know, should the remote fail. That's why I got the little, I like the little, it's like a switch blade, it's like Hopefully I never have to use that, but if I do, it's there. Hope this video is a value. Be sure to subscribe, share it with all your friends, share it with people on your car lot, and uh, be sure to subscribe, youtube.com forward slash iRixGuy. Thanks for watching, and y'all have a good day. Hey y'all, iRixGuy here. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to subscribe, like, and share. It's viewers like you that enable my channel to continue to grow. Thank you.